Hello students, welcome to class PM. In today's class, we are going to discuss some more topics from the spectroscopy. In the previous class, we will learn about electromagnetic radiations and their characteristic and electromagnetic spectrum and the parameters of electromagnetic radiation. In today's class, we are going to discuss some more topics related to the spectroscopy. So, let's first discuss about Planck's theory. What is this Planck's theory? So, according to the Max Planck, Electromagnetic radiations do not have the continuous energy, they have discontinuous energy, okay. So it says that electromagnetic radiations or the, the regular electromagnetism which we know is the light, the white light, the visible spectrum which we know. So this light trans produced and transmit in the form of packets of energy according to Planck, it said, according to Planck, it said this electromagnetic radiations are packets of energy. So each packet is called as quantum or the plural you can say quanta, singular it is quantum. So the light or LA electromagnetic radiation travel in the form of or propagate in the form of or possess a packet of energy. It is a composed of packets of energies. These packets are called quantum or quanta. So, every packet consists of H nu energy. What is H and what is nu? H is of Planck's constant. It is Planck's constant and its value is 6.626 into 10 to the power of minus 34 joule second. So, this is a Planck constant and nu is the frequency of the radiation. Frequency of the radiation. So, according to the Planck, any electromagnetic radiation produces, possesses discrete values as its energies. Like, it will have 1 H nu energy or 2 H nu energy or 3 H nu energy. Like, this kind of discrete values will be there. There is no continuous values like 1.1, 1.2, 1.3, 1.4. 1.5. No, such kind of energies do not occur only they have discrete values. Okay, so that is called the Planck's quantum theory. It says that electromagnetic radiations energy is also quantized. Quantized means any quantity which is having a fixed value. Okay, any quantity that is having fixed value we call it is quantized. So here the energy of electromagnetic radiations is quantized. They have a fixed values like this. Okay, so this is a Planck's quantum theory, it will help us to understand the spectroscopy much more better. That's why I discussed here. Now we will get into our topic that is spectroscopy. In today's class, we will discuss about what is spectrum and what are its applications.